Okay guys, this is Nick's Senator, um, fitted with our chiller. It's 32 degrees outside. He's currently got a vent temperature of 7.7. .7. Now we'll go plug into a stock car. So this one's bone stock. Put the probe in the exact same spot. If we go in. Okay. So it's coming down. Still, as you see, 32 degrees outside. So this car is 100% stock, nothing done to it. It's a uh, new GDSR. Both cars have been running at equal amount of time. They're up to full operational temperatures. It should come down that other bit and match up. Like I said, the when we recharge the AC system for the chillers, we can get them a little bit colder uh, than factory. But everything the same, all the parameters are the same. You know, on face, recirculate. Um, everything the same. So it looks like it's going to stay around there. 8.3. 8 I'll move it a touch. Maybe I'm in a slightly different spot. Oh, fell out there. Alright. It's a bit more accurate. As I said, everything is, um, you know, exactly the same. Uh, same fan speed, you know, the whole lot, everything's identical. Yeah, that's a better spot there. So, oscillating there, it looks like. So basically, you know, the chiller, obviously, as I said, not affecting the vent temperatures. There we go, same vent temps. So, Nick Senator over there, fitted with the chiller. And uh, this is a brand new GDS, it's GDSR, sorry. 4,625 kilometers and uh, no chiller on here at all. So, definitely not affecting vent temps. Uh, so you guys can see as well, Nick's fitted with the chiller there, as you can see. And uh, the GDSR obviously doesn't have a chiller, it's still new, haven't put one on this one yet.